Hello everybody, it's the Tech Tips to here again and today I'll be showing you how to obtain free and legal music for you to use in your YouTube videos. Now for us to be able to do this, the lovely people at Creative Commons have come up with a free licensing system for artists to distribute their work under. This license allows you to use the work of said artists who usually only ask for name and track credits in your video. Now without getting too into licensing right now, there's usually only one exception to this rule, and that is that you can't use music under a no derivative works license. I'll show you how to differentiate from this license throughout the video, but please go to the Creative Commons website for a more detailed look, and the link for that is in the description. Starting on the Creative Commons website, we can see that they do list some sources to obtain free music, but today I'm going to show you my top 5 and run you through how to best find music on those sites. First up is the freemusicarchive.org and the reason I like this site is because it's very well organized. If we go to by genre we can see that we have all the genres listed here and then if we click one of them we have a lot of subgenres as well which we can filter down to find the specific music we're after. So I'm just going to go to electronic and let's go to chill out music. Now we can see here all the artists and tracks for this genre are listed. We have the ability to preview them right from this screen and we can see there's 441 pages here so there's quite a bit of music available. So I'm just going to preview this track here. That's quite a cool sounding track that would be great for a montage or similar style of video. We have the ability to download the song right from this page if we need. But what we want to do is click on this track name just to get a little bit more info on what license this falls under. Now once this loads up we have all the information on the song, how many times it's been listened to when it was uploaded, more information on the album that it was released on. But the bit we're most interested in is over here on the right which is the licensing it's been licensed under. Now if you remember before the non-derivative license was the one which was not good for us on YouTube. This one doesn't have a non-derivative license so that's pretty good for us to use. You can click on this to get more information and that will bring you to this page which will describe the exact license that this music falls under and you can determine if this is okay for you to use. Now going back, this website also has a great search function and we can search by license type as well. So we can select these attribution only licenses and there's also allow for use in a remix of video which we should click as well. This will give us all the tracks available under this license and there are 44,000 tracks. Now we can still use the filters again here to drill down into finding what we want and you can be quite safe in using all these tracks on your YouTube videos. Next up is a site you've probably all heard of, Vimeo.com. What you might not know is they actually have a music store and you can access that at Vimeo.com forward slash music store and they have a whole lot of Creative Commons licensed content here for you to use for free. Now there's a few ways you can navigate through this. They have a music search function and they allow you to type in the mood or the feeling that you're looking for and the one I like to use is the recommendation so you can click that and I like to go by popularity you can see here on the right that you have license types, so some of them are purchasable, some of them are free. Let's just try this one here. That's a pretty cool sounding track. If we mouse over this question mark here, we can see that it's a share like 3.0. That's going to be fine to use on YouTube, so that's a great one to download straight from this button here. Now Vimeo's music search also has some advanced options, and it allows you to specify license type, specify price, and also specify instrumental or vocal type of music. Now this site is great, so definitely have a search through here and see if there's anything you like. Next on the list is Jamendo.com. This site's great, it has a ton of music, both free and paid for. Now to access that, we go to Discover up the top here. Where I like to start is the most popular section, so you click that and you get a list of the most popular songs for the current time. Now scrolling through, we can preview them straight from this page. And 
we have the player down here at the bottom. Now when we go to download this track, which is the button right here, it's going to give us the licensing terms for this track. So for this one we want to give credit to the artist, don't use this on an album or for commercial purposes, and distribute all your work under the same license as this one. So this track will be okay for use on YouTube, we can click that free download. Now let's have a look if we can find a non-downloadable one. So we can see with this track here, it has the ND tag, non-derivative, so we cannot use this track on YouTube because adding video and images to it would be altering the track. So just be aware of that when you go through these lists, but you can definitely find music that is available for use on YouTube. Now one other way we can navigate this website is through the search feature, and they also allow us to search via license type as well if we go to advanced search. So let's go to attribution only. So let's type in gaming. So that has a pretty cool 8 bit sort of style to it. And we can totally use this on videos on YouTube. And all we need to do is give credit to the artist. You can do that by adding their name and track to the description and probably a link to their website would be nice. Number four on our list is in Compotech.com. Now everything on this site is royalty free and we can get a quick overview of what we have available here by clicking at royalty free music in the top left. I like to start with the 19 most downloaded pieces of music as this has some of the more popular tracks on the website. So scrolling through we can see we have a listen button for all this music here and let's just try this one right now. So there's some tags, action, aggressive, dark, intense, which sort of suit that very well. If we click on more, we can see the licensing terms and they give you a nice, easy copy and paste for your YouTube video descriptions. Now, if you download that track, all you need to do is copy that into your video and you're free to go. Incompetech also has a search engine. You can access that from the full search in the royalty free music. And just like the other places, tick what you're interested in and click search. Now my last recommendation is freesound.org and this is not so much of a music site but a sound compilation site. So what you can do is go to search and type in something you're interested in. So I've been looking for a crowd chanting sort of sound recently. And here we go, let's try this one. Gives you some ideas of what's available. Some of them are good, some of them not so good. This one was actually not too bad, so clicking on a track we can get more information on its license type over here on the right. And this track is okay for use on YouTube. You have to log in to download, but it's as easy to do as the other sites. So log in, click there, and find the sounds that you need. So that's it guys, my top 5 free music sites for use on YouTube. I hope you liked this video, please leave me a comment with any of the sites you use. Hit like and subscribe if you enjoyed this video, and head over to my channel for more great videos.